The time now is 6.07. Thank you so much for joining us here on KQ2's hometown this morning. Courtney, great job with that story. Seeing those kids playing with snowballs, that's to show you the type of snow we had. It was more of a wet snow that can easily freeze in temperatures like this. Big shout out to our director, Joseph, for giving me the snowball to play with. So it's definitely a snowball snowman day for you kiddos, as many of you are off school today and parents let your kids play in the snow. It's fun. And look at these snowfall amounts that we received here from this winter storm over the last 48 hours. Mostly we received anywhere between four to five inches of snow here across the region. But some areas like Cameron into Rockport, seven, eight plus inches of snow. So depending on where you lived and where those heavier snow bands are was where the heavier snow amounts were. And unfortunately, we are not done with the snow just yet as we are expecting another winter storm to push through here late Thursday into Friday. You can see the snow cover roads and the snow pack out there this morning. That is allowing those temperatures to be on the cold side this morning in the teens. But we are seeing a southeast wind pick up as a warm front's going to be pushing through here. And that's going to help those temperatures go from the teens this morning into the 30s by the afternoon. But bundle up as you're heading out the door, everyone, as temperatures will only be in the teens into the 20s for most of the morning with a mix of sun and clouds. Again, roads are still slick and snow covered out there, so please allow for some extra travel time as you head out to your final destinations. Courtney. Thank you, Vanessa.